Hey guys, it's Ashley from Not A True Reviews and today I'm unboxing the Bonding Bees subscription. This is a new date night subscription box. Um, so basically each box is for you and your partner to sh have a shared experience. The boxes are themed, but they're like completely secret until they're sent to you. So it's like supposed to be a fun surprise to open together and like experience it together. Now, I'm unboxing it here um, without my partner, but <laughs> so whoops, but anyway. Um, so that's that. They are $34.25 if you're on a month-to-month -month basis. They do have reduced prices if you subscribe for a longer time. Um, so let's, without further ado, let's pop this open and see what's inside. Okay, I do love the box though. Isn't it cute? I've been like in love with this subscription since I saw it. I'm like, what a cute. That's going to be so cute. So, all right. So we have right on the top a whole bunch of papers and stuff. So Bonding Bees, A Night in Paris, The City of Love. Ooh. And I, I think I've told you guys that my husband, he's not from France, but he's French. Um, so that, so that this will like kind of uh, translate a little, I guess. Communication will be key to this Paris inspired date night. I don't want to go through this too much in case there's some like clues as to what's in the box. Now they did say that there can be, it's going to be like activities, crafts, recipes, things to do together. And then you'll even get like little gifts and home decor items here and there and whatnot like that. Okay, so looks like we're going to be painting because there's little canvases in here. All right. Oh my gosh. Oh, so I forgot about this. She had sent, she had asked me to send the, the curator had asked me to send her a picture of me and my husband. And there's a little magnet. Isn't that cute? It's from when we got married. Oh, I love it. Okay. Anyway, I had to, okay. I forgot about that. Oh, it's really a surprise. I forget everything though. So waking up and you know, everything's a surprise. All right, set the mood. Oh, they have a their own playlist, so you can go to their website and they have a music page. Uh, gather, give, grow. Bring everything to the side and focus on spending quality time together. Give each other by investing. Uh, they do have a referral program. I don't know what's going on here. All right, so anyway. All right, there's that. That's telling you about the referral program and kind of gather, give, and grow is their mantra where you're going to get everything together. You're going to, uh, you know, da -da -da. I'm trying to, you know, fit this all into one video. There's a lot of information here. All right, so we have a little love post postcard or pretty little picture thing. It's cute, huh? The French Connection Language of Love. Oh, so these are like little projects. So this is like a little uh, puzzle. You all oh, see... He'll kick butt at this, right? Because they're all like, like simple sayings. Um, and you have to connect them to the French and then the English. You have to connect them. So that's cute, right? That's fun too. Ooh. Okay. Challenge of the month, the five love languages. <gasps> I know about the five. I've read the, that book. Um, is a New York Times number one bestseller. It's by Gary Chapman. If you're in a relationship and you haven't read this, even if you're a parent, um, they have one for parents and I'm, I'm actually currently reading that one. Um, if you have not read that book, you need to because like it opens up your eyes to a different way of thinking about caring and how some people, you think they don't care, but they just care differently. I, it's a, an amazing and it's very simple. It's not complex. It's not hard to understand, but for some reason, you don't think of it like that because nobody's presented it that way to you. I don't know. Five love languages. Look it up. All right. So on the back of the card, there's the five love languages. Um, see if you guessed right by taking the... Oh, we actually do... And this is funny. We take this quiz like once a year. Just to see, I think, because at different times in your life, you may have different needs in love and what you're looking for in your, in your relationship. Um, so we always take it to kind of get an idea of where each other is at. I can tell you right now that I'm a quality time and my husband is, he's a words of affirmation, but he's also a physical touch person. So this is cool. Very, very cool. And I like to see that people are spreading the word about that because it's like, it's very simple and it is so helpful. I always, when I go to a wedding, I always get them like, I give them money and then I will buy them that book. It's just like a thing that I do. All right. So here you write down your love language. All right, bon appetit. Ooh, is this a recipe? It is. Oh, crepes. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. We make crepes. We actually own crepe pans. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> They're like, like, I don't know if you don't know what a crepe is. It's like a really, really thin pancake, a little larger though. And you can put, we put um, sugar and lemon juice in ours 
that's not going to work for everybody that's ours this is with strawberry cream though and that sounds so yum yum all right so we have two little canvases here so i guess we're going to be painting something Are we going to be painting this picture here? I'm wondering. Possib possibly? All right, so we have a little snack to share. We have some marshmallows to share. We have some Rice Krispie Treats to share. Are we making s'mores or something? We must be because look, there's chocolate chips. There's marshmallows. That's kind of cool. What's this? What's going on? What is this? Is it like fondue? No way. It is. It's a fun, like a mini fondue. Yes, I actually had this once in a Thai restaurant. They came out with a tea light under my food. It was curry. It wasn't obviously it wasn't fondue, but um, I was like amazed. I was like, wow, that's so beautiful. It was so magical. So that is so cool. So you can make like little s'mores with each other. Or pretzels. You're probably supposed to make chocolate covered pretzels with marshmallows and stuff like that. Oh, that's so cool. And so here are our, um, oops. We each get a set of paint and we each get a set of paint brushes and we can make a painting. Now let me try to find the paper with the information about. I'm going to look at this one because we didn't peek at this earlier. This will probably tell us a whole lot about the box. Enclosed, you'll find two canvases, paint, and some sample paintings. Sorry, I'm like adjusting. Uh, bring out your inner, those are sample paintings. I wasn't incorrect. Your inner Picasso as you paint a picture. Uh, the extra challenge is to communicate and work together so that both of your paintings make one big picture. The sample paintings are just meant for inspiration. Feel free to use one of the pictures or come up with something simple and meaningful to you both. Aw, that's so cute. All right, so the French connection, we saw that. That's the little scramble where you connect the phrases in French and English. The love language, we saw that. Who wants dessert? So we've included all the goodies needed to enjoy some yummy and romantic fondue together. Just put the chocolate chips in the fondue set, light the candle, and wait for it to melt. I just think this is so cute. Um, for faster results, you may want to heat it in the microwave. <laughs> um, and then the recipe card, and that's the crepes recipe. So that is everything that we received in our bonding bees. I cannot wait to do this. It looks like so much fun. Um, I love the theme. I think it all came together really well. I think it's cute and it's fun. And my husband, I don't know if you guys remember me seeing this, but my husband is so tired of watching TV. He's like, I don't want to do this anymore. I need to do fun th other things at night. Like that's our time. Like we chill. Like at, at like nine o'clock, we we would watch shows and he's like, I'm tired of this, let's read a book, let's do a puzzle, let's do something besides television. I just think it's pointless and mindless. So he will enjoy this a lot. Um, if you're interested, please do check out the full blog review below and also check out Bonding Bees, who I will link to as well. And as always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I also might have a coupon code for you guys. I'm pretty sure I do. I'll put that down below as well. Um, and I will see you next time. Bye.